I'm so excited not only to learn about the history of Germany, but also the culture and the home life of the people who live in Germany. I did the other exchange where a German student came and stayed with me, and I'm really excited to go back and visit her because we really bonded, and we're going skiing on the Swiss Alps, so that will be fun. I want to learn to be a little bit more independent, be able to go and travel like this. I'm excited about, like, seeing more of the similarities, not the differences of their lives, and seeing, like, how close we actually are, even though we're so far away from each other. Every morning before work, every evening after work, all the prisoners had to line up here according to barrack number. Yeah, we're still serving the flow of traffic. I'll show you over here. I was kind of surprised by how many memorials there were. I was expecting there to be some, but um, there were more than I had expected. Especially in Berlin, everywhere you turn is a point of historical interest or a memorial or something like that. Connecting with like other people my age around the world and uh, getting to learn about what they experience day to day, getting to understand other people's points of view, that has really changed me. Like It's affected how I look at the world around me. Um, I also feel like I've become more independent. So when you got there, what, were, what was your thoughts on living with a host? Uh, at first it was a little awkward because I wasn't quite, I didn't know these people at all and I was just going to their home, but it got more comfortable as the trip went on. <laughs> so what's something you're going to miss? Um, I'll miss losing in Monopoly. <laughs> <laughs> what about you? I'll miss biking to school with Julia. Most things are new there because of World War II, and I thought many of the buildings would be old, when in reality a lot of them were rebuilt after the war. While each city holds their own interesting vibe, I thought that Berlin was really cool, while Munich was more traditional. The differences were vast, and I really loved Berlin. My favorite moment of the trip was going to Dachau. That was my favorite part of the entire trip. It was deeply impactful, moving, very interesting, but um, you could definitely uh, feel it. That you could feel something deeper there. I feel I definitely can handle the independence out there, and um, that I'm able to be away from that long. But um, I also thought I. I learned a lot, um, factually, about Germany and stuff, so that was good. I'll definitely be heading back to Europe at some point.